And not you're just not just creeping on me because that'd be really creepy. I don't like creepy ghosts. One of the most scariest ghosts in Battle Frame 2 was for, um, where you have to get the free pinwheels for the old tree and then you go to the graveyard before you fight um, Broken Neck Lady. Um, when you before you literally fight her when you examine the um, when you examine the gravestone, if you turn round behind you, there's a little girl behind the gravestone creeping on you. And it's really creepy. Um, right, where the hell am I going? Um, okay, let's go upstairs, but like, oh no. Ah, let's go upstairs, but like the other way. Because that needs a key up the ladder. You need a key. Um, so yeah, I don't really know where else to go. Um, so we'll go back, and then we'll go up the stairs uh, beforehand. Oh, hello. Cutscene. Who, you? Hello. Oh, it's the creepy creepers. I thought I'd ask you to be nice. Don't creep on me. Don't fucking creep on me, bitch. Jump scare in three, two, one, zero, minus one. Most two. <clears throat> Where did he go? She's below. She's under. Yeah. Look. Hello. Why is she? Why is Ray scared? Ray, calm down. Oh, Ray, you get touched. Don't. No. Don't you fucking touch me. Oh my god! I told you to be nice. I don't want to battle you. You're rude and annoying. Okay. Right. Come on then. Think you can fuck with me? Do you know how pro I am at this game? Oh god, help! 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 Oh! 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 Shit! She's got a creepy face! Oh! Shell a chance! Was that good? I don't know. Okay, right. She's got a creepy face, dude! Okay, 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 they're fast, they're fast, they're fast, they're fast! She has got a creepy ass face! Oh! 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 Damn! She's creepy! Okay. Right. I don't know what's going on. Um, oh wait. My voice went a little funny then. Um, let's go to file, let's go to battle, and then let me combat, yeah, there we go. Um, right. There we go. If you catch a vengeful ghost in your capture circle, you can charge your spirit power. The more you charge your spirit power, the more damage you inflict. Okay. How do I charge it? Does it charge automatically? Because I didn't really see much of a charge. I don't know. Maybe I was just like not looking. Um, your shot of chance is the instant the capture circle turns red. If you shoot at this instant, the damage you inflict increases and you can also cause vengeful ghosts to withdraw. If you wait to shoot and draw in the vengeful ghost as close as possible, you can obtain the greatest amount of charge during your shutter chance. By doing this, you can inflict great damage on the vengeful ghost, which is probably a fatal frame. I'm assuming. Yeah, a zero shot. I'm assuming that's a fatal frame. Right. Okay. Right. Um, let's go back. Right, uh, next time I fight, um, hopefully I will have to have a look at the, um, the charging because yeah I didn't really see much charging going on I was just waiting for the uh shot a chance to go off the red circle thing someone's leg someone lost their leg oh it's the crying girl it's not my fault that I'm the only one that survived I should have been taken I didn't survive because I wanted to I had no choice if I had just had more I would have I didn't survive because I wanted is she alive or is she real? If I had died with everyone else, yes, yes, if I had died with everyone else, then I would. Are you alright? Oh god. Oh god. Is she real? I'm just gonna take a drink. I'm assuming she is. Oh. Oh. Oh god. Ray? Ray? Turn round. Ray, turn round. Ray, turn around. Oh my, what, what is that? Oh, it's the creeper. No, wait, is it? I don't think so. Oh no, is that the ghost from the like, beginning that like, touched us? Sexually? I'm coming. Oh, 
She has boobies. Oh my god, what's wrong with that face? What's wrong with her face? Booby ghost! She's gone. No, she's not. She tried to touch my boobies. God damn it, battery controller. Why you do this? She's trying to touch my boobs. So stop. No. Don't touch Ray. Ray, run faster. No, no, no. Oh, no. She... She touched me, didn't she? <laughs> oh, damn. Oh, my God. Guys, this little frame game is like nothing I've played before. This game is incredible. It, it's got such a different feel, seriously. It ripped from the, far, the, from the past two games. They were so similar. But this one's got such a different feel to it. It really has. What's going on? Heartburn? Oh, no. Ray? Um. Miku, not now, please. Is everything okay? No, I've been just harassed in my dreams. I... I heard you cry out. Oh, I was worried. You've been having so many nightmares lately. What? I'm fine. But I... I... I just... had a bad dream. Why is the audio out of sync? I don't really know. That's not something I've done, guys. It looks like... The voices come before their mouth moves. Oh, that's not me. That's in the game. Because I can see that now if you guys notice that. That's not me in my editing. That's just the game. And we magically turn into a new costume. Was it all just a dream? I don't know. I better get up. Tattooed woman. Oh, so she has a name. Not, um, booby woman. She's... Tattooed ghost. Okay. Uh, notebook. During the course of the game, uh, when you find new information, it will be recorded in the notebook. When there is a new entry in the notebook, the title will appear in the top right, like we saw a minute ago. You can access the notebook from the menu. If you press L1 while the item name is shown at the top right, you can refer to that item. That's really useful. Thank you. Okay, so we've got some new files to read through, which I'm going to do. So, uh, yeah. So, bruises appear. Let's read that. Ooh, they look nasty. I felt a sharp pain in my shoulder when I woke up. For a moment, I thought I could see some kind of bruise on my skin. But when I looked again, there was nothing there. Was it just a dream? Who knows? Who knows? Okay. Location. The abandoned house. I wasn't motivated enough to find out much about the place before I went. About all I knew was that it was supposed to be haunted. What's behind the strange daydream vision I had in the house in the snow? Was I just worn out? Still scarred by the accident? Or the rumours are true? Was he really there? Manner of sleep. The ruined house I wandered in my sleep the night I got back after my vision on that assignment. Something about it reminded me of the haunted house where I saw you. It seemed too real to be a dream. Daydreams. Visions. Maybe I'm just tired. People. You, Asu. My fiancé. He was an editor who worked on the books of the folklore. Physio oh god. Philosophy. Philosophy. There we go. Philosophy. Why did I know that word? Seriously, I know that word. Philosophy. And anthropology anthropology maybe he we met students he was the opposite of me in every way quiet and kind like gentle falling rain like a shaft shower that washes everything clean 
He passed away two months ago in an accident caused by my careless driving. So she's blaming herself for her, his death. That's what I'm assuming anyway. Miku Hin Asaki. Yeah. Um, so this is Miku from the first game. You guys should know Miku. Uh, Miku, younger sister of Yu's best friend. She lives with me now and works as my assistant. I haven't met her brother. Yu told me she, um, she had lost a relative in an accident. She helps me out in all kinds of ways, not just with work. She's cheerful and hardworking. If not for her, I don't know how I would have made it through after Yu's passed away. Okay. The tattooed woman. The woman who appeared in my dream of the manor, her whole bo body covered in blue tattoo. She came closer and I ran away before I knew what was happening. All I remember is an intense fear. I can still feel her cold, stabbing fingers on the back of my shoulder where she touched me. It's hard to believe it was only a dream. Mother and daughter. The mother and child who appeared in my dream in an old-fashioned kimono. They were looking for someone, calling out a name in a sad voice to him. Who could that be? Okay. And that is all the files, guys. So, I'm really sorry, guys. I'm going to have to leave it here for the moment. But I'll be back in just a moment. You guys will... Yeah. I need to ch charge my controller. So, I'll be back in just a moment. Okay, then. So, my controller is nice and charged. So, I think we're going to go ahead and look around Ray's house. I'm assuming this is Ray's house. It might be... Uh, oh, no. It is Ray's house because uh, in the file it said, Miku live with Ray. Oh, sorry. Uh, there isn't a tape I want to listen to now. Okay, fair enough. Uh, why is she, she wearing like slippers? What the hell? Uh, oh, see what she's got in here. Rummage through our stuff. Clothes. Never been a tidy person. Fine. That's fine. We're not all tidy all the time, are we? That's fine. I know I'm not, anyway. Anyway, uh, what the fuck was that? I don't know. Good morning, oh! Ray. Hey, Miku! It's a little cat! Mr. Cat! Oh, you're carrying my camera around. Let's take a picture of Mr. Cat. He's so cute! Little cat. There we go. Right, let's go in here. This is Miku's room. Even if this is my house, I don't really like to go in her room without permission. I know Miku wouldn't care at all, though. Go fucking in! Okay, never mind. Um, <laughs> This is my house. I will do what I want. Uh, Yu's room. Ever since the accident, I try not to come in here unless I have a good reason. Fair enough. Wait, what the hell? But if Ray's... If Ray, Ray and you are, like, fiancés, then why don't they just, like, sleep together? Why have they got separate rooms? That doesn't make sense. Miku. Good morning, Ray. It looks like it's going to rain all day today, too. You don't have to work so much this week, so why don't you just try and relax? Ray, you've been working too much lately. You were woken up by a bad dream this morning. Not to mention what happened when we were out collecting data the other day. Anyway, let's try to make it easy today. That reminds me, there was a letter. It addressed to you, it's addressed to you. Not as in you, Ray, um, Ray it's uh... Yeah, you. <laughs> letter from Kai, one. Dear you, sorry for not writing for so long. How are things with your fiancé? I'm continuing my investigation on the urban legend. Like I thought, my niece's symptoms bear many similarities to the strange disease, a disease associated with the urban legend. I think most of the story is groundless rumour, but I've heard there was a psychiatric study done. If you have it, I'd like to see it. Maybe it will provide a clue. I'm taking a break from all... The fucking cat stopped me owing. <laughs> I'm taking a break from all my other work to devote myself to studying the urban legend. I'd like your help. According to documents I've studied that the camera I sent you is apparently a rare camera obscura. Given where I found it, it may have some connection to the missing people and the urban legend. If you hear anything, please tell me. Regards, Kai Amakura. It's from Kai Amakura. He's written several times before. Have you still not told him about you? Use camera obscura. I wonder if it would be in Yu's room. Okay, we got a new file. Um...
Wait. Where's our notebook notes? People? Kai and Makura? I've never met him before, uh, personally. But he was a friend of you. He used to write from time to time. Gyu seems to have lots of people, both professionally and privately. According to the letter, he and you were doing research into urban legends. Maybe the camera obscura was somehow connected with that. I just heard about the accident. Okay. Cool. Let's have a little look around our house then. I'm going to shoot that cat. If it carries on meowing. TV. Ooh, what's in here? Ooh, kitchen! Is there food in the kitchen? Food. Uh, what does it say? Uh... Okay. Can I have some food? Noodles! I want noodles. I like noodles. Noodles are so good. Okay. Ah, uh, get out of the... I'm stuck. There we go. Okay, what's up here? Front door? Oh no, in a, cor a door corridor. Oh, okay. It looks like a front door. This must be our front door. Uh... Yeah, front door. She keeps it locked. Good idea. Okay. Bathroom! She lost a little weight. Oh. Okay. Bathroom. Bathrooms are creepy. Oh, this more this looks more like a Japanese house now. It looked very modern before actually. Okay. Um some cushions, old books. I'm just skimming through these guys. I'm not really want to read them to be honest. Use altar. You let's have a look. Ah, cute. Right, let's go. Oh shit, how long is this corridor? Oh, where am ah, where am I? Wait. Okay, right, I'm good. I'm good, I'm good. Right, what's it what's in here? Uh no one's inside the toilet. I would hope no one's inside the toilet, um, Ray, because you're here and Mika's in the living room, so... Hmm. So they've got, like, their toilets in, like, a different place to their bathroom. That's strange. Uh, this is the dark room. I don't think we can actually do anything here. Maybe we can, maybe we can't. Maybe later on, maybe. I don't know. Uh, okay. I don't think there's anything in here. Okay, let's go back out. I'm just having a little nose around the house, to be honest. Um, yes, this little nose. What's out here? Oh, a storage cupboard. Okay. Nothing in there. Nothing of importance. Okay, let's go back to. We need to go to use room. Actually, we need to go look in there. We need to go look for the camera. See if he's still got it. Ah, oh, the cat's eating. That's why I've not heard it meow in a while. Whoa, Ray is so tall compared to uh, Miku. Wow. Okay. Clump, 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 clump. Okay. Cool slippers. Let's go to use room. There's something uh, about some sort of camera obscura that you owned written in the letter. The camera obscura? Could it be the same camera I saw in my dream? Ooh, weird. Okay. Ooh, cutscene. Oh, now I hear the rain. I didn't hear the rain before. Is that a computer on the desk? There it is. Ray, oh, may I help you with something? Oh, I just wanted to ask you. Why have they got separate rooms? I'm not too sure about that. Poor Ray. She totally blames herself for killing her fiance. That's really sad. It's really, really sad.
Me? 